I'm sorry, family. I still got. I'm investing. It's it's hard. I'm it's broken up. I, I'm sorry, but God will send you a spirit to hearten your heart. So you got all these. It's either spirits coming from God. He's putting down the spirit to his children for some for whatever reason that he's using it for. Remember, everything that God does, he does it for the glory of his kingdom. So it's a purpose behind it. But then you also have spirits that come from the devil. And this spirit right here is the spirit of disbelief. Remember what I said. This is not necessarily a demon, but it might as well be because they're doing the same damn thing. You know what I'm saying? They're doing the same thing. So I don't know how you go understand this and implement it in your life. But it's two different types of spirits when they come from the devil. It's either a spirit like this, the spirit of disbelief. Or it's a demon. You know what I'm saying? Same thing with God. Same exact thing. There are similarities in it too. You got to imagine. The devil imitates anything that God does. Anything. Anything. People be sitting up there. They be all like, my child. My child is possessed by the, a, a demon. When you have the Holy Spirit in you, it's the same thing. That's just what I'm saying to y'all. You know what I'm saying? There are similarities. And there's so much spiritual warfare that's happening and that's going on in your day to day life. So you got to prepare for these things. And you've been wondering why you've been talking all this good stuff and this person still haven't been released. They got the spirit. What is it? The spirit of disbelief on them. They is not going to change their ways. They are not. They're fighting against the Holy Spirit. I told y'all. They can fight as long as they want. You know what I'm saying? If they're not God's child, they're going to fight the Holy Spirit to the day they die. If they are God's child, it's only so much fighting against the Holy Spirit that you could do before a person has to submit to God. Hallelujah. Amen. Now, family, I got to get out of here and I got to prepare for the next show. Peace and blessings be upon you in the name of Jesus Christ, for he is the Lord. You know, I'm going to say it. Express love today. Show some love today. Express love to these people, all your brothers and sisters out here in the world, for we make up the body of Christ, for we make up the human family. Show some love, people. Show some love, family. Express some love, family. This is your brother, Jehoshaphat. Peace and blessings be upon you.